everybody! It's me, Andrea Macassette, and I'm here to answer some of your questions. So let's get to it. What were some of your roles in middle school and high school? In middle school, I played a pepper shaker in Beauty and the Beast, and then I played Anne Shirley in Anne of Green Gables, and Ida in Honk. And that was grade six, seven, and eight. And then in high school, I played Jojo in Susical. And I played Velma Kelly in Chicago. I played Hortense in The Boyfriend. And I played Brenda Bly in Brenda Bly the Musical. What inspired you to start theater and what's your favorite thing about it? Um, growing up, I watched a lot of Disney, so I loved stories that came out of Disney. Um, I've always loved to sing and dance growing up and um, my parents kind of clocked that right away. So they put me in anything that they could find um, would use that energy out of me. And my favorite thing is just the way it impacts people. Love that. What was the first show you ever did and how old were you? The first show I ever did was a Catholic musical called Celebrate Jesus. I was six and it was 2000, 2002. I was a little angel. What's the best part about Broadway? Is it the feeling of knowing you made it or dot dot dot? The best part about Broadway is just being a part of it. It's still very, very magical despite the circumstances right now. Um, it's a dream come true. I don't know if I made it. I feel like my time on Broadway was very short. And I look forward to going back and seeing what I can do to impact others in the most positive and uplifting way. Um, so yeah, that's my answer. Uh, how do you deal with negative comments? Um, usually I laugh it off. I mean, it's not deep for me, whatever, but there are days where I, where they really get to me and I'm only human. So I talk to friends and family who give me words of affirmation and encouragement. And sometimes you just gotta let the haters hate. Any tips for starting musical theater? Um, my biggest tip is be open and be willing to collaborate and have fun. What were you doing when you found out Broadway shut down? I was in my apartment in New York City getting ready for the official opening of Six the Musical. I was still in my pajamas. I didn't know what was going on. I was texting my cast being like, so do we shower or nah? Yeah, in my apartment. What has been the most rewarding part of your six journey so far? The fans and being able to represent little Filipino girls who have big dreams of being on stage and just validating that dream because it is possible. And I love meeting you guys and um, just sharing that with you. So that has been the most rewarding. What do you think the acting world will look like after COVID? Well, I hope it looks like a rainbow. I hope that people are given equal opportunity. I hope that people of all shapes, sizes, and races 
are represented. I don't think people know how much we rely on art to get us through the day. I hope that people cherish it. And I think that is what the acting arts world will and should look like. Quote of the day is, love yourself, cause you're the shit. If you like these videos, please like, comment, subscribe, and let me know in the comments what kind of content you want to see.